Welcome home, Sarah. Lightning, why are you here? Because you want me to be. In this place, you can see all your heart's desires come true. You've changed history, and you're back where you belong. This is it. Your adventure's over. Sarah, come with me. Your family's waiting. Yes. My family? That's right. I'm home. My family are all here. Deep in my heart, the truth still glinted like a razor. This wasn't real. It was a dream. If I accepted it, my journey through time would end. But... My sister was here. Snow was here. If I stayed, I would be with everyone I'd ever loved. This is what I'd been searching for. All this time. I'd found my home. I'd found happiness. Sarah, let's go. Yeah. Make my wish come true, Just being here with my sister fills me with joy. I'm home. In some ways, it's almost like that happiness has taken over, forcing out the feelings that were there before. At first I was overwhelmed with loss, but soon even that feeling faded away with the rest. Now every day is paradise. Lightning is here with me, and snow as well. Lebro and Huge, Godot and Mackie, the whole gang. Sometimes Saz and his son come to visit. And guess what? Hope had some great news for us. He said he was pretty sure they might be able to save Fang and Vanille from the pillar. I'm content. I like my life the way it is. There's only one thing that keeps it from being perfect. I can't remember a certain person. I know he was a friend. And I'm sure we were close. But no matter how I try, I can't recall his face or his name or even how his voice sounded. It's so strange. Who could he be? In my room, I have a mirror. I never use it. It scares me. On the other side of that mirror, there's a whole other world. And if I peek inside, I'll be lost. Or so it seems to me. When I told Snow how I felt, of course he said I was just being silly. Maybe I am. I can live with that. All I want is for these wonderful, magical days to continue this time to stretch on forever. This is where I'll stay. I'm home, and I never want to leave. <laughs>